What is the difference between climate and weather? You commonly hear politicians confusing these two terms and therefore really failing to understand climate change. The next slide provides a good example. In December 2017, Trump tweeted the following. In the East, it could be the coldest New Year's Eve on record. Perhaps we could use a little bit of that good old global warming that our country, but not other countries, was going to pay trillions of dollars to protect against. Bundle up. Can you explain some of the confusion in his statement? Do you know the difference between climate and weather? What is weather? Can you explain to me what weather is? Weather is the state of the atmosphere at a given time and place. On the morning I was recording this, I looked out my window to describe the weather for you. Clear, sunny, 29 degrees Celsius, a light breeze, no clouds. Really a perfect day to be outside and enjoying the end of summer. Several variables can be used to describe weather, including temperature, pressure, humidity, precipitation, visibility, winds, clouds, and pollution. How would you describe the weather where you are today? The images here are taken from weather sites. Both show conditions at a specific time and place. The satellite image on the left could be used to describe cloud cover across North America, while the image on the right shows high pressure and low pressure points and storm fronts in the United States. How is weather different from climate? What is climate? Can you explain climate to me? Climate is the mean state of the atmosphere, hydrosphere, land surface system over a given period of time and space. Climate is described using means, frequencies, extremes, and variances. Previously, I described weather in London on August 8, 2020. I could also describe the climate of London for the month of August. Based on a 30-year average from Environment Canada, the average August temperature in London is 19.7 degrees Celsius. The average precipitation for August is 82.9 millimeters. The images here are from the Ontario Climate Data Portal and describe climate across Ontario. The top image shows the average annual temperature for Ontario and the bottom image the average annual precipitation for Ontario. The black circle shows roughly where London is. Based on these maps, how would you describe the annual average climate of London relative to the rest of Ontario? Warm and wet, right? These unique climate conditions mean that Southern Ontario also has unique vegetation, which is described as Carolinian forest. When we talk about climate or climate change, we are talking about long-term conditions and trends in climate data. Let's go back to Trump's tweet. Hopefully, it is clear now that Trump is confusing weather for climate. 